You hate smoking. Roger, can you please take that out of your mouth? Freezing my balls off out here. <laughs> What's that phrase you used to say? So cold I could cut glass with my nipples. <laughs> I told that joke in my acrylics class. Everyone burst out laughing. All credit went to you, of course. Gregory's in that class. Biochem still kicking your butt? Please tell me you're getting enough sleep. Kinda cruel to break up with me here of all places, isn't it? We haven't talked in days, Roger. I feel awful. I am so sorry. No more sorries for the rest of this conversation. I know what you want to say, and I don't blame you. So you remember this place? Of course. This is where we first said that we loved each other. You do remember. How could I forget? Because you must have forgotten all about me when you were with him. Why'd you do it, Miranda? Details aren't important. We were together three years. Don't tell me what's important. It wasn't just physical, was it? How? Just say what you wanted to say. You are in no place to be mad. <laughs> I am in no place. Who, who was there for you during college apps or when your grandma died or, or when your parents fought? And I'm thankful for everything. Thankful. Greg and I got close because of you. Because of me? You're a control freak, Roger. You always need attention. You make everything about yourself. You know how stressed I've been. When my grandma died, you demanded me to be with you and you said not to talk about it because it's too depressing. Okay, and Greg was there for me emotionally. It only recently became physical. Why didn't you just tell me? Because you wouldn't have listened. Too busy studying to become a successful doctor. Why care about what some dumb art major has to say? Did I deserve this? No. No, you didn't deserve any of this. That's, that's why I'm so sorry. No sorry. Sorry. Wait. Shit. <laughs> You're not just some dumb art major. I feel like it. You have your whole future ahead of you. You were bound to leave me in the dust at some point. You were the one who kept me on track. These last couple days without you were miserable, partly because... I couldn't wrap my head around everything. Roger. I should hate you, but how can I? I was a crappy boyfriend, and you found someone else to make you happy. It's my fault. It's not your fault. Everything seemed so perfect and... It wasn't all bad. But now I know, and, and now that I know, I want to do better. But what are you trying to say? Even after everything, I still love you. I can't talk right now. Okay. I'll be home soon. Bye. Love you too.
this, this was not supposed to happen. I was gonna let you end things. I didn't know that you still felt that way. I'm sorry. Oh God, I'm really sorry. Mm.